Greetings, hello guys. So as you know from the title, I've been banned. So let's talk about it a little bit. So what happened is one of our members was saying on our Discord channel that everybody's land claim had been sort of removed on this server. Even some bases were destroyed and he suspects it's an admin stuff. I'm not quite sure about that, but we will never know, I think. So he told us this on Discord channel, I wasn't even like, okay, what the fuck? And then they were like sending uh, screenshots that multiple foundations were destroyed and stuff like that. So I wasn't really paying attention to this stuff, maybe it was a player or something like that. But then two days after, in the morning I was logging in and I checked before logging in my Discord and another member was saying we got banned. I was like, what? Did you guys cheat? Do anything wrong or what happened? And he was saying no to his knowledge and to other clanmates knowledge, nobody did any abuse uh, against the rules of uh, official servers so what happened is basically i tried to log in and this is what i see on my stream i was like okay cool so i started talking to them what happened and they were like again repeating that some bases got destroyed and they got banned too so it's really interesting for me that some parts of the bases are still there and they got destroyed and stuff like that and i know this could be admins work because one click and the base is poof gone. I know that. And same thing happens when you server transfer. Your whole base is or can just go decay and you can just destroy it with one poof. But it wasn't really the case. So I don't know what happened if it was admin or it was a player doing that because there's some crazy YouTube videos out there about the abusing this server transfer system. The players can just one shot foundations and whole bases just collapses and it's crazy. So I just wrote a forum post that uh, what happened and maybe somebody knows about it and actually one of the players from another clan also replied to my um, post and he was saying yeah it's true they got also banned and their whole base is gone and they don't know what happened so I wrote to Funcom directly on Zendesk and asked why we got banned and it turned out that we abused the land claim system. I was like what? Okay, let's say we did. But the other clans didn't really do that. Like I know two clans specifically that they didn't do it. Because one was starter, like actually just started on the server a few days ago. I wasn't playing there, but uh, the guys told me that uh, he got also banned and stuff like that because they had his contact and they were like talking or something like that. And um, he got also banned. And it's like uh, pretty interesting stuff for me. But whatever. So eventually we got banned, the whole clan for land claiming. We had a little bit too much of um, foundations around the base. That's the answer I got actually. And yeah, that, I mean, it depends. Like, please define it in foundation pieces. Like you can build like 40 foundations away from the base and stuff like that. But the thing is, is that I'm so angry at this point because there are some other official servers where players have two blocks of stuff. They have castles, they have, I don't know, bases, they have like land claims and stuff like that. And they do not get banned. And I don't know what's the thing about this. And I'm not even talking about that players who are actually cheating do not get banned. There's Chinese players streaming online on their own country's website that they are cheating on their meshing fly bases and stuff like that and on this server where we were playing we not i didn't but i know that the russians who are playing there found two sky bases of one other clan and i guess they got screenshots and stuff like that but they still do not get banned because i don't know why probably they do not get as many reports as we do and what i suspect is the ones who are cheating are reporting the players who are not cheating actually to get banned so they get another advantage and this is so crazy and i don't know i had a little bit enough of this shit so so it's crazy but yeah i still got plans to do and 
hopefully I will be able to share it with you guys as I'm planning to record from now on. I found another software which I can use for recording and for now it seems it's working. Hopefully it, does, it won't crack or anything like that. Right now it's cool. Knock knock, you know. So yeah, it's, it's crazy shit what's happening on official servers. And we all have to adapt to it. We have to accept it that you get banned and stuff. And the thing is, is that actually this is my second ban for the same issue. Before, like, I don't know, a year earlier, or even a little bit more, I was playing with another clan and I got banned for the same issue. I wasn't playing with them, I was on vacation. And when I come home from vacation, all I see is that Discord spam, we got banned, we got banned. And um, I wasn't even playing, I was just still in the clan. And I try to log in and I see that on my screen that I got banned. So, crazy. And what I'm really angry about is that they... I, I asked it like directly and I told them the issue and stuff like that. Is that they don't really say anything about it. Okay, what's the limit of land claim you can have? And what happened to the other guys who on the same server? Like I know it's kind of private information. But still, I'm really curious, you know. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. I'm gonna talk about in the next video about the 2.5 changes and what I've experienced so far and what my advice is for transporting loot over servers and, and what solutions have I found for different kind of problems and some interesting stuff. You, you will see it. So, I'll see you in the next one. Up until then, guys. Bye.